Now come to the non-functional testing. Non-functional testing includes the performance, the load testing. We have already discussed about the performance. We have discussed about the load testing in which we have to find out till what extent the application accepts the load. We have discussed about the stress testing till what extent the application will be failed and we have already seen the difference between the load and the stress testing, the usability testing. Usability testing, how the application is user friendly means we have to check the ease of users. We have already discussed the same thing by taking the example of the ATM machines of SBI bank and ICSA banks and so on. Maintainability testing that we will discuss in detail in the upcoming slides. Reliability testing, portability and known functional testing basically focus on the fun characteristics maintainability testing that whatever the software product are going to be designed that can be maintained easily or if any kind of threat any kind of leakage any kind of failure will be found it get failed reliability testing to test the applications that until what circumstances the application is reliable to the users or not portability testing take an example of a c program i have done a programming on one laptop take the program into my pen drive and access onto the another laptop whether the program can be portable or not whether the program will be run or not non-functional testing basically focuses on the characteristics on the systems and consider the external behavior of the systems non-functionality testing covers each and every part like the look and feel the cosmetics portability issues, performance issues and so on.